Welcome back, everybody. This is W Balls Th- W Balls O three. Hard for me to say. Along with <laughs> Okay. Let's see here. Our plan is to get the last missile container in, uh, I was going to say Brenstar, but we're in Norfair, so yes. you want to get it right around here, which I have to wait for the acid to go down. Uh, be a girl and just go in. <laughs> and you bomb around here, there we go. And like, Sothix8402 would say, how in, the sh- how in the hell would you figure that shit out? You actually heard me then. Yeah, but who has time for that? Yeah, so let me think here. You're like one, two. Okay, well, let's see. One, two, three. We have 215 missiles. Yep. Damn, space pirates just die, man. Just die. Yeah, those are tough suckers. Yeah, they are. And this is the proper way you exit Norfair, not through the acid hey. room. <laughs> yeah, you go out through this way and we'll show you where it comes out and then we're gonna meet you in Brenstar. Give me shit about it. You want you want acid swimming that time. Alright. I did. Well this actually takes you out to where we got the wave beam a long time ago. Yeah. It didn't seem so long time ago for us, though. Yep. It's, it seems like maybe a, an hour and a half ago. <laughs> and yeah, so we're back here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop the video and we'll, we will meet you back to Brenstar. We'll be right back. All right, everybody, we're back. And T Stout is on with us right now. He will be back soon as possible. But we're back in Brinstar. And if you remember, this is where I got the charge beam. So, what I wanted to show you this is the stuff I did not get. So, you want to go through here, come up here, use the power bomb. And I'd actually keep the power bomb on. Destroy these hoppers with the power bomb. There's another power bomb. And also use power bombs on this wall. And we're back to the beginning where we got the morph ball. So what we want to do is we want to try to destroy everything in this room. Use the power bomb here. That creates a path up here. Now let's see if I can do this. Yeah, like a dumbass you are. Yeah, like dumbass I am. Didn't you say dumbass? No, I don't think. Oh, I thought I heard you say dumbass, sorry. All right, you're not a dumbass. <laughs> and we're walking on an invisible bridge. It's not invisible if you x-ray it. Yeah, but it's invisible to the naked eye. Okay. Yeah, I'm back, everyone, sorry. That's all right. I, I had to make coffee. Oh, you gotta have. I talked to my mother on the telephone. Yeah. What does your mother have to say? Nothing, I thought I was busy, I had to go. <laughs> Of course, we're we're playing the be- one of the best games ever. I I I always do that for Huh? Yeah. Yeah, we're so we're going to get the last uh, bit of uh, stuff. Nice. I'm just gonna power bomb this all out and make it easier. Yeah, so we're getting down to the nitty gritty. The nitty gritty. Yep. And up we go. Yep. It's funny, you start out, you know, right here, and then you basically almost end the game where you started. Uh-huh. 
Seven prednisone per dose, seven and a half, which, yeah, which makes you eat like a horse and you can't have any salt because you'll blow up like a, I don't know, like a balloon. And, uh, yeah, so that happened in 93, 94, I believe. And, uh, oh, okay, so, so you're about seven, eight years old, nine, nine years old. Yeah, and I just, and I, you weigh about 150 pounds because you're fat. Yeah, I was huge because it made me huge. I was a little kid and then it just totally, made me huge. I mean, I couldn't help it. I had to eat like so many meals a day because you know, you're, you're taking all that prednisone and it just makes you want to eat and you have to eat. Yeah. And it was funny. I never got foot cramps before prednisone and like I get foot cramps ever since, which is crazy. Are you going to demonstrate what happens if a Metroid jumps on you? That's okay. Oh yeah, here we go. <laughs> 
No, I did on accident. Come on, get off me. Oh, now I can't get up. I've fallen and I can't get up. Oh, man, I screwed up again. Yeah, this is it. Oh, man, that one almost hit me, too. Wow. But yeah, but that was, uh, that's when I, and you know what, whenever I had my blood disorder, that's, uh, I think my grandma bought me a Sega Genesis, so that was oh, like, that's where you was at, just playing the Sega. I was playing Sonic and all that stuff, and yeah. oh man, that Metroid just came flying down. Can I please not, yeah, can I please not screw up on one of my last videos, I've done so awesome, well besides that. It's a, it's a law. Besides the jumping in uh, Bren, Bren Star, jumping on that, uh, where all them rippers are at to get yeah, the first. That's before, I, that's before I can. Yeah, you'll get to see that though. Yeah, if, if I was there, I would have done that because it's like I can't screw up in front of the master. I gotta make it slow <laughs> No, I'm not a master by any means. I just know where everything is. But there's a stuff in this game I still can't do. Like, I can't walk the ball very good. I can't bomb jump to save my life. So yeah, and then we got Cheerios for breakfast. Yeah, and you remember my last LP, we said there's no way to destroy these things? Well, there is. Yeah. Uh, but I'm not going to do it. Five, five super missiles. Five super missiles. Okay. So, can I just ask like the dumbest question? What? Why does why won't they let you kill this one up here? I think you can. No, not this one, because this guy comes in the cutscene, takes place, and eventually jumps on. And honestly, what I'm gonna do just to speed things up, I'm going to take off my gravity suit, various suit, and I think that's it. I don't think it matters. That don't matter anymore. And I'm back yeah, to you. Hey folks, I showed this to him. Yeah. Well, actually, yeah, you uh, you showed me a video of my guy. I think we learned it at the same time, actually. No, because I watched the video before you did it. No, because I remember you said, "Wow, he actually took off his various suit. That's smart." Yeah, this is like the world record in uh, in Metroid. It's like the world record is like twenty-eight minutes, folks. Yeah. It, yeah. And there is the tiny Metroid of Metroid 2. That's the Metroid that Ridley captured. And it grew up to a Super Metroid. And he, and he still thinks that Samus is his mother. <laughs> Couldn't remember at first. Right whenever he's about to kill her, he's like, Oh, that's my mommy. I can't kill her. Yeah. Alright, here's your challenge. Okay, one time. No. So, no. Charge it up to get one missile. Okay. 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 No. 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 <laughs> it's four, you got four reserve tank. That's enough. That's okay. Oh God. Come on, man. You can do it whenever you revisit this game. If you do it. I might someday. Probably next year, like August or something. <laughs> You know, you know the month down, huh? Yeah, probably sometime. I don't know. I'm waiting for someone to make me a Super Metroid hack. Yeah. What I'm waiting for. That's a, that's the notorious save room. Yeah. You gotta think actually what I would do instead of doing the uh, the full energy thing. I'd come out here and shoot Cheerios until I got my energy up. Yeah. Do you remember the glitch? On the save room? No, the glitch on this room. Uh, yeah, I remember you showed me something. Yeah, there's a way like the game glitches and all the, the walls or whatever the hell they're called. I forget what those things are called. Yeah. But there's a name for them. There is a name for them. Alright, it's Mother Brain time. Why? Because we're almost at 15 minutes. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna end it soon. Yeah, I want to know that. I thought you were probably. I thought you 
she's just going to destroy them and just end the video. All right, I'll end the video. This has been W Balls 03 along with Thomas 25. And we will see you people later. Bye. Bye.